Jediism or Jedism is a philosophy mainly based on the depiction of the Jedi characters in Star Wars media. Jediism attracted public attention in 2001 when a number of people recorded their religion as Jedi on national censuses. Jediism is inspired by certain elements of Star Wars, namely the fictional religion of the Jedi. Early websites dedicated to bringing up a belief system from the Star Wars films were, "...the Jedi religion and regulations", and "...Jediism". These websites cited the Jedi Code, consisting of 21 maxims, as the starting point for a "...real Jedi", belief system. The real-world Jediism movement has no founder or central structure. Topic. Beliefs Although followers of Jediism acknowledge the influence of Star Wars on their religion, by following the moral and spiritual codes demonstrated by the fictional Jedi, they also insist their path is different from that of the fictional characters and that Jediism does not focus on the myth and fiction found in Star Wars. While there is some variation in teaching, the Jedi of the Temple of the Jedi Order follows the 16 teachings based on the presentation of the fictional Jedi, such as, Jedi are mindful of the negative emotions which lead to the dark side, and Jedi are guardians of peace and justice. Adherents also follow 21 maxims. Topic. Census phenomenon Jediism received press coverage following a worldwide email campaign in 2001 urging people to write, Jedi, as their answer to the religion classification question in their country's census, resulting in the Jedi census phenomenon. The majority of such respondents are assumed to have claimed the faith as a joke. Topic: Legal recognition. Topic: <inaudible> United States. In 2007, the Temple of the Jedi Order was registered in Texas. It was granted IRS tax exemption in 2015. Topic: United Kingdom. During the drafting of the UK Racial and Religious Hatred Act, an amendment was proposed that excluded Jedi Knights from any protection, along with Satanists and believers in animal sacrifice. The amendment was subsequently withdrawn. The proposer explaining that it was a bit of a joke. To illustrate a point that defining religious belief in legislation is difficult, in 2007, 23 year old Daniel Jones founded the Church of Jediism with his brother Barney, believing that the 2001 UK census recognised Jediism as a religion, and that there were more Jedi than Scientologists in Britain. In 2009, Jones was removed from a Tesco supermarket in Bangor, North Wales, for refusing to remove his hood on a religious basis. The owner justified Jones's ejection by saying, "He hasn't been banned. Jedi's are very welcome to shop in our stores, although we would ask them to remove their hoods." Obi Wan Kenobi, Yoda, and Luke Skywalker all appeared hoodless without ever going over to the dark side, and we are only aware of the Emperor as one who never removed his hood. In 2010, a man who described himself as a Star Wars follower and Jedi Knight was thrown out of a job center in Southend, Essex, for refusing to remove his hood, and later received an apology. The man said that, "...the main reason is I want to wear my hood up, and I have got a religion which allows me to do that." 
In 2013, the Free Church of Scotland expressed concern that a proposed marriage and civil partnership bill would lead to Star Wars Jedi marrying couples. Patrick Day Childs of the Church of Jediism, and Rev. Michael Kitchen of Temple of the Jedi Order, both defended the right of Jedi to perform marriage ceremonies. In December 2016, the Charity Commission for England and Wales rejected an application to grant charitable organisation status to the Temple of the Jedi Order, ruling that the group did not promote moral or ethical improvement for charity law purposes. Topic: Turkey. In April 2015, the students of Dokuz Ilul University in Turkey started a petition on Change.org demanding a Jedi temple be built on the campus. The petition was in response to a previous petition which had demanded a mosque on the campus of Istanbul Technical University (ITU). The petition demanding the mosque reached 180,000 signatures falling short of its 200,000 target and invoked a response from Mehmet Karaka, the rector of Istanbul Technical University promising, "...a landmark mosque". Soon after, students from other universities started petitions demanding Jedi and Buddhist temples on their campuses. See also List of religious ideas in science fiction <laughs>